So right now we're in the aeroplane and we're going from Seychelles to Dubai. I'm gonna show you exactly how my day looks like as a CEO of a software company. My company is based in Dubai. It's a copmember.com, it's an LMS software. The time right now is around 10. We'll arrive in around three hours. So right now I'm having my breakfast and uh, I'm gonna show you exactly how my day looks like. Good morning from Dubai. The time is around 7.40 and today I'm gonna show you exactly how I run my day as the CEO of a software company. So obviously every time I wake up, I wait myself. I drink water today because I'm in a hotel. Usually I do uh, my shake. In around 20 minutes, some of my employees are coming to visit me in the hotel and uh, we're gonna shoot an interview about the, the software. I don't really know what to expect. I told them to not tell me because I like to come up unprepared and natural when it comes to the interviews. And uh, now the first thing that I always do, I have my laptop over here and I'm gonna start checking emails and the Slack. These are the two things that I always monitor to see that everything is running smoothly. And I'm gonna show you overall today how my day uh, goes like as a CEO of a software company. Obviously, this is a different edition because I'm traveling at the moment. So expect to see uh, also kind of different stuff. So let's start. All right, guys, so it's time to meet my employees and uh, let's see if they're gonna show up on time. I'm told them 8 o'clock to be here, now it's 7.55. Let's have a look. Okay, guys, they just arrived. You guys are in the vlog. We're shooting a, a day in a life as a CEO of a software company today. And this is Florian, CEO of Marketing MBA. And Sebastian. What are you doing, by the way? Head of product. Head of product. Amazing. Amazing. Cool. So, where is Jonas? Honestly, where is Jonas? I'm going to cause him a problem because we need to be on time when we have meetings. <laughs> um, How are you? I'm Tell good us. Good, good to see you. I'm gonna grab some food later, but first of all, let's... Maybe you can show us your hotel. Hotel? Because this... I, I don't know what we're allowed to film, but we will try our best. <laughs> so I think it's better to start outside, and the more we hurry up, the less people there are. So I suggest that we go straight outside to see what's Perfect. around, and do okay. an interview or whatever you guys want. Okay, guys, so we just got out from the hotel. What? what do you think, Sebastian? All good. We found a solution. Yeah, of course, as always. Solution is the most important. Problems are treasures. Now we will go to an even better location with even more inspired people. And it's exactly. a greater setting, so it's all about the setup. <laughs> exactly. New location, hopefully we're not gonna get kicked out at the point, Dubai. Tell us about what do you do in Cop Member? So um, I'm a head of product of Cop Member, that means I do yeah, yeah. like everything to keep everything together. Um, the marketing department, uh, the sales and the support department uh, and see where we can improve the user experience and make it better for everyone. Exactly, so this is the guy we are relying every day to make sure that everything runs smoothly and on point. I always do my best. I also have my friend Mo here. I'm the guy with the camera. Same camera like me, right? FX3? Yeah, yeah. We got the same. There she is. Wow. This is exactly what happens when you're in a rush. Oh no! Exactly. Sick. Sick. So what we're we gonna do more? What, what videos we're we gonna shoot? I have no idea. I just came here with the camera. <laughs> <laughs> What's the number one takeaway that you have from the army that it's helping you right now in your everyday life? Every day only about an hour sleep. Every day maybe one bottle of water. And every day maybe 700, 800 calories. But you fight and you perform the mission and you lead 80 commando soldiers. And that was the main learning. And later when I was in, in, in companies like Amazon or number one consultancies or in, in Dubai, now no boss at all, no clients, no issue can stress me. 
feel like the old man in the round with the coffee. <laughs> you are. <laughs> Thank you very much. Oh, our drink looks very garish, by the way. For then shake, as usual. Uh, then I'm gonna go back to the hotel, maybe have some breakfast, and then it's time to do some training after we finish the interview with the guys. Are the women getting treated the same like the men, or you're going so far? First, women and men got, get treated equally, and second, we care for honor, we care for loyalty, we care for actually care for each other, and very honest, like we call it radical honesty. When you give a, when we give feedbacks, never with the intention to harm anybody or to put anybody down, but to show blind spots where he or she can still raise the bar or still can evolve into his or her best version. And that's sometimes tough, sometimes bold. Yeah, you know, sometimes it's it's really tough uh, at the company because um, you have to be so so cool, like this state of mind you were talking about, like smiling from the inside even when. Uh, external, there's hell and everything burns and you think you're done, you have to get in this mode of just continue. But do you smiling. think it's worth it? Of course, it's, worth it. it's always worth it. I mean, it's it's a nice company, it's the nicest software you ever saw everywhere. Do you say this because it's the video shooting? <laughs> <laughs> you get paid for that. I was six weeks into the course, I was doing masters in internet engineering and then I realized that this is not for me, I don't want to do this anymore. I went to the university and I signed the papers to quit. By the end of the month, I had to come up with 1,300 pounds to pay the rent. I had three weeks to make money to survive. That was the most difficult part. And that's how I, I, I built a very solid foundation in my life. And then moved to Cyprus and um, I, I partnered with my brother, with Software CY, with Senos Fitness under Software CY. Then we built the, the software. Then Raul came to us two years ago to buy the software, portion of the software. Yeah, that was the, um, the story. And I hope that there is gonna be more stories in the future. All right, guys, so I just finished my breakfast. Okay, as you can see, this is the physique. Okay, so what did I have for breakfast? Uh, most likely 1000 calories, I will say. Obviously very high protein. I also, before that, the meeting with the uh, with the guys, I had a protein shake there, so this is basically my food for the day when I'm traveling. Why are you filming me, by the way? <laughs> I'm gonna film you back. I'm talking to my brother. Let, let me just speak to Pav. Show him, show him me. Show him me. Whoa! You are in the vlog! Flexing over here. <laughs> cool! <laughs> my plan right now, after I also finish the a call with my brother is to maybe go to the gym. Alright guys, so I'm back from the gym and the real question is what does the CEO of COP member do? Which in this case is basically me. A lot of different stuff. As you know, I need to check what Jonas is doing. As you know, Jonas is the head of the product, which obviously overviews all the departments. We have marketing department, HR department, support department, development department, and he needs to check all of this. And in my case, as a CEO, I have to make sure that everything runs smoothly and I'm more involved into high level operations and high level decisions. For example, next week we have a webinar, which is coming up with COP member, and uh, it's a collaboration with CopCard, which CopCard is our mother company. And they have a lot of customers and we're gonna do like a presentation to them what COP member is all about. A few days after, we have an event with Der Kreuter, which is very big marketer, sales uh, coach in Germany. And this is also going to be big. So in my case, this is what I do. I always overview that everything runs smoothly. I spend most of my time on Slack. I check different channels, what is going on in each channel, in each department. And I have to give my feedback and opinions on how things are running, mainly what uh, we do with my brother Sergio is the development, which is the biggest part of running a software and in my opinion, the most important because if the development is not good and if the product is not good, obviously the customers will not buy and will not stay on the product. So 
this is a, a quick introduction about what the CEO of COP member is doing. And uh, right now, we're gonna do some more calls. We're gonna check what is going on in the Slack group. And then I'm gonna go and chill at the beach. Obviously, this is not how every day is. It's just because uh, I'm traveling, but usually the day, the way it goes is you wake up, you go to the gym and you work, okay? There is no fancy stuff. There is no fancy hotels. There is no fancy restaurants. It's pure work focused and making sure that we are on our way to hit the goals that we set to, uh, and, and that's it. It's as simple as that. One eternity later. All right, guys, so we need to wrap this video. And I really want to thank you for uh, being here with me. You saw my, exactly my life, how it is as the CEO of a software company. And this is when I'm traveling, obviously. Usually, I just go to the gym and then work all day. You also met some of my employees. Right now, I'm going to go for a dinner with my wife, Libanese cuisine, my favorite. And if you like this type of videos, make sure you like, make sure you subscribe, because we gonna plan to have more videos in the next few weeks if you have any questions to ask me about fitness or business just comment below and i'm gonna get back to you so thank you again and see you on the next video